What better way to mark the retirement of the MD-80 from Assassin's fleet than a party in the air, taking one of the planes into the sky for a bon voyage celebration of food, friends, and fun? Welcome to Nordic Megadoo 2013. Thanks to an incredible SAS purser, the plane was decorated special for our flight. Even the crew got in on documenting the scene. And while the pilots worked on final touches to the flight plans, we did our best to herd more than 130 passengers onto the plane in hopes of something resembling an on-time departure. We were almost close. A quick safety demo, with help from a passenger, and we all took our seats for the flight. Note that one lucky rider had a much better seat than the others. The first flight was a quick hop from Oslo to Stockholm. We actually ended up a bit delayed on the arrival because we were eating and drinking too much such that the cleanup dragged on. Fortunately, we had some extra hands on board to help with the trash collection before landing. It wasn't just about the food and drinks. Many of us stopped to grab parting shots of the MD-82 as we made our way from the gate to the lounge for the next part of the event. The crew joined us in the lounge for the party and they were treated like rock stars, complete with paparazzi-style flashbulbs at one point. After our quick stop in Stockholm, it was back on board our plane. For this departure, we had the bonus of boarding through the rear door on a beautiful, sunny day. 
that resulted in some incredible photo opportunities and a bit more of a delay in the schedule as we worked to get everybody on the plane. Another safety demo conducted by a passenger and another cockpit briefing for an auction winner, and it was, once again, time to fly. And now, a three-hour joyride over Scandinavia in the MD-82. It most certainly was happy hour in the sky. Some of the passengers assisted as well, helping the crew make sure that drinks were flowing and being shared around the cabin. Several ACARS transmissions were sent to our plane by those on the ground who knew of the party. Lots and lots and lots of friends on board the flight. Everyone was having fun, and we've got the photos to prove it. Later in the flight, we made a low pass over Stavanger, getting close to the fjords, glaciers, and other beauty of the Norwegian coastline. And then, all too soon, it was time to land in Copenhagen, bringing an end to this portion of the Megadoo. Bye-bye. Thanks for flying with us today.